It's Mother's Day weekend, and one of Habitat for Humanity's annual projects is getting underway in the Broadmoor community in Jackson, the Women's Bill, where the initiative for rehabilitation of one of the homes in the area is headed up by women. For many, many years, Beta Delta Omega and Alpha Kappa Alpha internationally have supported economic issues, and we know home ownership is very, very important for your economic legacy. Broadmoor was a GI neighborhood, settled primarily by returning World War II veterans. And over the decades, as their families grew, the wider spaces of the suburbs attracted the original homeowners, and the houses they left behind became primarily rental property. But there's a return to what was originally here, people purchasing and living in their own homes. Habitat for Humanity is helping with the process. Meryl McEwen is the executive director of Habitat for the Capital Area. This is a neighborhood that has everything. It has grocery stores nearby and wonderful schools. And as more and more people become invested in the well-being of a community through home ownership, the character of the area is enhanced. And that has many positive implications, including putting a check on crime. We've actually been recognized by MetLife uh, and won a large award because we could statistically prove that habitat being in a neighborhood had reduced the crime. We have 199 houses in Midtown. And what's so exciting is it took a minute, but now there are businesses down in Midtown. There, there are coffee shops opening in Midtown. And what's happening in Midtown is about to happen in Broadmoor. Over the next five years, we plan to affect 100 houses. Other people will begin to come back. You know, it's kind of a proven fact, uh, physically, psychologically, theologically, and every other way that when you turn on the light, the darkness leaves. Duh. Crime likes dark places. Habitat for Humanity and home ownership and neighborhood investment by property owners is one way of bringing light back into our neighborhoods.